Hi, how are you guys doing today? My name is Animo and today we're going to be playing a brand spanking new game, City Quest, developed by Stone Monkey Studios. And, um, Stone Monkey, not Stoned Monkey, although I'm sure you could do both. That's a versatile name if I ever saw one. Anyway, this game looks really fun, okay? And I'm fucking excited. Let's go! Hit to the play! Oh, new game? Yes, please. Oh my goodness, what is that? That's a hillbilly factory. This here big city plane has been in the air for nearly three hours now. Much too long! Scream your hillbilly sensibilities! <laughs> I've always wanted to be a hillbilly. This plane is in flight from Alabamingham, North Texalina. <laughs> And on it sits a country bumpkin out there to see the world. That bumpkin is you. Your quest is to make it in the big city. This is your story. Try not to die too much. Yeehaw and uh, yippee ki -yay, as they say. Don't worry, I'll try to sound even more white next time. Pins and needles. That was a mighty long flight and your legs are numb. You should walk around a bit to shake off the pins and needles. Select the walk icon then click in the scene to walk around click to continue oh my <gasps> it's a point and click game yes Ooh. oh your legs are feeling better but you have no idea where you're going have a look at the directory over there select the look icon and click the directory object i am stoked okay let's click the eyeball and stare at this object right here I got an achievement! That's probably the hardest one I've ever had to do. Click to continue. Gate, bags, toilets, info. The toilets take up a clean... 5% of the whole entire airport. Tummies are rumbling. Now you know where the baggage claim is, but you're feeling a bit hungry. You should find somewhere to graze. <laughs> find somewhere to graze. Yeah! But first we must examine things. God damn it. God... Fine! I'll be productive instead of being like an annoying gamer like, Yeah, I must find all the stuff. Tough choices. Wow, so many choices! Take that, Dragon Age! Back home, your choices were slop or feed. Actually, it doesn't look much different. Click the face icon, then click on a person to talk to them. Try it on one of these food peddlers. Ooh, that's a face! That's a face! Click on it, and you. Welcome to Burger Town! Home of the town, Burger! Can I take your order, please? One triple bacon Swiss and onion town burger please click to select okay here's your burger have a burgertastic day burgertastic appease the tummy god oh that guy gets really violent when he's not appeased looks like it's made of grease and cardboard tasty tasty cardboard you can eat the food by clicking your face icon and clicking it in your inventory yes okay let's do it let's get this burgie Oh, again to appease the tummy god I didn't know that was a religious game you ravenously devour the food stuff it is flavorless but filling very nice. Hmm, better get rid of that filthy wrapper. Maybe in a trash can or, you know, wherever. Littering is illegal! You can give an item to someone or place an item somewhere by first clicking the hand icon, then clicking the inventory icon, then finally clicking a person, place or thing in the scene. Okay, so this is the hand and we can take this and put it there. Full and no longer burdened by trash, you figure it's about time to grab your bag, grab a cab, and get to the city. I'm sure a baggage claim is around here somewhere. Let's go! Hey, I want to talk to you. Um, can I just... <laughs> just want to stare at you. <laughs> nice pizza you got there. Is it a pizza? I'm not really sure. Let's talk to you. Oh, the woman grimaces. <laughs> can I help you? Hi, ah, can you recommend one of these fine establishments? Her gaze softens slightly. Well, son, truthfully, they're all equally bad. But Burger Town is the greasiest. Thank you, ma'am. Oh, thank you, lady. Her gaze softens. Welcome to Whack Diggles. <laughs> Whack Diggles. Is that supposed to be McDonald's? Can't say that. We'll get a copyright strike. Mm, I don't seem to have any money left. Oh, my goodness. Have I ever had money? Well, let's get moving, shall we? I have two sorts of inventory, it seems. Ooh, let's go to the bathroom. The mundane things that become so exciting when you're playing a video game. Hello, excuse me! Can I palm the door seductively? Oh shit! You boldly pick up the bathroom floor cupcake. Old farm habits die hard in the big city, it appears. Oh, there's a cupcake in there! And some pee. Is that really a cupcake? Moving on, let's go in here. Hello? Hey! Hi! Hi! Fine, ignore me then. Rude. Can I look at myself? Ooh. You make a move to kiss the mirror, man. It is not even close to what you expected. <laughs> oh no, I love this. 
I love this. It's reminding me of jazz punk. Can I? Excuse me. Oh, I can stare at this. What's this? Vending machine. The machine dispenses treats in exchange for money. It is making strange burbling noises. Okay. Well, what's this? Oh. No, no, no. Let's go up here. Yes, no. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. You poke at the hobo. He doesn't respond. He feels a bit cold. Then again, you're pretty chilly in here too. It's probably nothing. Well, along with that disturbing stuff, let's f move on, shall we? Aha! Ha-ha! <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't really figure that out for some reason. It wasn't letting me do it. Okay, so we're here now. Let's go and stare at this fetching young... Oh, there is a short man garbed in the finery of the exotic east. Hmm, that sounds delicious. Let's go and stare at this lady. Well-dressed woman. This woman is dressed in smart business clothes. There is very little to amuse you about her appearance. Entertain me, woman! How dare you be so selfish as to not amuse me at all. Let's go up here again. Let's go and chat with you, information person. Stare at you. Information booth attendant, this is an attractive woman dressed in a sharp blue blouse. She looks more friendly than anyone you've ever met on your travels thus far. Well, thank you for looking so friendly. Let's get down here. Hot and brown. That's how I like them! Let's touch them. Why are you standing so close to me? Just trying to figure out if you have any wobbly bits or dangly parts. <laughs> get away from me. <laughs> His her voice does nothing to say to you. To say to your curiosity. <laughs> Does nothing to say to you. His suit is smooth and elegant to the touch. He seems a bit too terrified to ask you to stop. <laughs> so we're just like palming with these people. Clown, you poke at the clown as a child might, enraptured by his unusual appearance. It's going to poke you too. Shirtless muscle man! You reach your hand towards the muscled god, but timidly withdraw at the last second. Oh, I guess we're too shy for that hot and brown barista. You try with all your might to lay hands on the man, but the further you reach, the further he retreats. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so funny that he wants to touch the peop to touch people specifically. Well, let's get moseying on, shall we? Oh no, whoops! Baggage reclaim, baggage reclaim! Oh god. We can go left, I think. Baggage reclaim! Yes, son! Ooh, let's go and touch this guy. <gasps> ah! That burning bag was most definitely yours! How unfortunate! Maybe someone with the airport can reimburse you because clearly this was not your fault. My f my bag just exploded into flames before my eyes. Is that normal? Let's touch this man. That'll make me feel better. Hey, don't touch me. Sorry, I don't know what came over me. <laughs> You're attached. So shiny. Oh, we can. It's multiple choice. I never actually knew. <laughs> Wipe away tear. <laughs> oh, well, good job we figured that out now. They seem to be unclaimed bags. Unfortunately, none of them are yours. They're all much too nice to be yours. Aww. The corpse of your bag. The corpse. Here lie the remains of your worldly possessions. Quite the predicament, you reckon? I reckon so. I guess we can... Maybe we can go and talk to the uh, information lady. Uh, hello, excuse me. Can I... Oh. <gasps> oh my goodness. Hi. Let's go and touch you up. The woman accepts your hug as a loving mother might. <laughs> Thank you, Sister Carrie. Can I stare at her? This is a woman of the cloth, dressed in her finest. She's appreciating the art. A uh, savage modern piece of art. You have trouble understanding the meaning, if there even is one. The paint looks a bit chunky. Nighttime cityscape. It's a nighttime painting of the cityscape. The detail is amazing. You take a moment to catch your breath after beholding such beauty. That just looks like a smear. Restored paint. Oh, it's that. It's that. That really funny restored painting. This plaque indicates that this was painted sometime in the 1800s and was recently restored by a master art historian. Ah, you guys, that's nice. Let's go over here. Walking past Hot and Brown, clearly the best place in the game and the only way to have your coffee. Information booth attendant, attractive young woman, yes. Can I please palm you up? Thrust your hand toward the I'm not missing a beat. She extends her own to meet you with a nice platonic handshake. Oh my god! Pro information booth assistant. Hi there, how can I help you? Yes, my bag has just burst into flames. Oh my, that's not good. Unfortunately, that qualifies as an act of God, so there's not much I can do for you. <laughs> well, the rest of my money was in that bag. Well, I can offer you a cab voucher, but that's the best I can do. Your fair face hides an icy heart and an empty head. <laughs> <laughs> Escape from the airport! You've had enough of this airport. There is nothing left for you here but death and sorrow. <laughs> Time to find a cab and get out of here. Death and sorrow. Yay! Game saved! I guess it auto saves. Well, we should talk to the nun, actually. I haven't been talking to people. Hello, dear. Peace be with you. And also with you. 
Well, that was worthwhile, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's get going. Let's get going. Actually, can I talk to Hot and Brown? Hello. I'm sorry, sir. You'll have to move to the back of the line. Oops. Sheepishly retreat from the counter. Express your displeasure with a series of snarls. There we go. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Back away doing your best impression of a T-Rex. Oh, that's amazing. This game is amazing. Let's leave. Ooh, so there's the aforementioned cab. Uh, can we explore anywhere else? Be an annoying gamer, you know. Have a little explore. Oh, you know what? Let's just hop into the cab, yeah? No! Oh, my goodness. If game people were real, they'd just walk around sort of spasmodically because of being controlled by somebody stupid. Let's go and stare at the taxi. The vast amounts of yellow on this machine indicate that it is either a bee or a taxi. Either way, you are sceptical. Let's go and poke it. Where are you going, pal? Uh, wherever this will get me. Never mind, I'll come back later. Actually, okay, okay, let's, 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 let's go and explore, because we have the option to come back later, so let's go and do that. Yes, yes, okay, fine, fine. Can I- Damn it! Let's touch you. You reach through the open window of the booth and poke the guard. He swats lazily at your hand and goes back to his nap. Let's go and chat with him, though. Huh? What? What do you want? You are terrible at your job. <laughs> Never mind, go back to sleep. <laughs> Leave me alone. No one comes by in the middle of the day anyway. Okay, well, let's go and use this. Hop in, boyo. Game saved. Okay, what wonders await us in the beautiful city of... of wherever we're, we are. <laughs> I know we came from, like, Texas something uh it was like, it sounded like Texas, but an ice cream flavor. So it was like Texarilla or something like that. Head to the big city. Can I control anything here? Oh! 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 We could have been there forever. Well, here's your stop, bub. <laughs> Are you Wolverine? <laughs> but this doesn't like a very nice neighborhood. I will get stabbed here. You wouldn't be the first, pal. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome to Hooklin. Leave the cab kicking and screaming. That's good. Silent dignity is a little bit of a stretch. Sleep disorder. Well, that's some bad luck. It's getting late. Best find a place to sleep. What an exciting adventure. Game saved. What is that? Abandoned building. This building looks abandoned. It, in better days, it may have been a brothel or even a crack house, but its glory days are long past. Let's go and chat with you. Let's first stare at this guy. He looks like a pirate. Hobo, this man is filthy, smelly, and frankly unpleasant to be around. He does, however, seem free. Let's go and touch him. Compelled by some unknown force. You reach out and vigorously shake the hobo's hand. He seems pleased with the human contact. Let's chat with him. Eh? Got any change? Hey there, crazy. I've always dreamt of being a hobo. I do not. Okay. Hmm. Let's say that. He looks at you over for a moment, then a faint glimmer of recognition crosses his face. Are you sure, Shunny? It's a hard life. In! What's first? Wonderful! First thing you need to do is learn to scavenge for, gr scavenge for grub. Fill that belly and come find me again. I shall gorge on the finest filth. Yes! But let's go in here. I'm interested. What is that? Joves? Joves? Oh! We're in some kind of kind of pubby club. Lady Barfly. This woman appears to be a little upset. Not terribly upset, just a little. Well, let's not go and poke the lady with our filthy hippie hands. Hippie hands? Hillbilly hands! Whoa. Can't get those mixed up. Yes, did you want something? Stammer over your own tongue and leave. <laughs> Neat. What do you want, kid? Uh, that's a nice suit. What are you doing in a crummy place like this? Um, let's see. Watch it! This place is a gem. Besides, it's nice to have a low-key place to conduct business. Oh, that sounds shady! I like it! He looks you over for a moment. Hmm. You look like you'd do alright in prison. Listen, if you're looking for work, I could use someone to run a few errands. I'm great at those! He chuckles a bit. I like your enthusiasm. Look, I need you to deliver this bag of... Uh... Candy to the politician down the street. My name's Jimmy, by the way. Got it, Jimmy. Candy Street politician bag. Yay! Well, we're on some quests right now, so let's go and chat with you, Mr. Bartender. What can I get for you, pal? Nothing. I'm bitterly broke. Sorry, you're cute, but I don't do free drinks. Shame. Uh, at least he said I was cute. Oh, let's go and stare at that, actually. Love tester. 
This machine claims to rate your love abilities. You wonder if it's accurate. Um, yeah, let's rate our love abilities, excuse me. Oh. The machine exploded. 15 minutes in and we found all kinds of toilets. Well, let's go and touch everything. Oh, there we go. Yes, no, no, yeah. Oh my goodness, he just had a massive slash. Look at all that, it's like all over the floor. Have some dignity, man! Well, whatever, let's blow this popsicle stand. Is this our, our politician friend? Uh, let's stare at him first. This is an older man with rosy cheeks and a neat field of white rolls over his chin. He is slowly drinking a beer. Let's chat with you, sir. <laughs> oh boy, oh did I get into the brew today. Joe's been good to me, I tell ya. Yeah, you told me. Leave. <laughs> oh yeah? Yes, indeed. You know, it's my birthday. I told old Joe to give me one on the house, being a special day and all. And do you know what he told me? Damn it, neither do I. <laughs> it was a hoot though, no doubt. Well, anyway, he pours me a beer of five, all without asking for a dime. That Joe, what a good guy. You're a funny guy, Rigo. Yeah, let's walk away. Bust up car. This once proud car has long outlived its glory days. The front is littered with bottles and cigarette butts. And there is a pink dress hanging out the window. Radical! Can I take the pink dress? Come to think of it. Please! You touch the cool glass of the building. It is cool and made of glass. Oh my goodness, an alleyway. Hello, sir! This poor guy is curled up in the fetal position. You feel something akin to remorse for a moment, but it passes. Hello! Shout loudly at the hobo. I'm pretty good at that. Oh no, I didn't move! Oh dear! Oh, I didn't mean- Oh! Mmm, no! Okay, can I interact with this? This trash can? Whoa! So let's go and look over here. Ooh, are you- Are you the politician? Sea man. Um, it's- it's a man in full and formal navy uniform. I, I read that as gravy uniform and got very excited. You're not sure where the nearest port is, but it's probably not nearby. I wonder why he's down here. Let's touch him seductively. He looks pretty angry. That's probably not a great decision, especially since we've had our first death. What the fuck? The man grimaces at you. Are you aren't, kid? I admire your dedication to pacing, sir. Never mind and leave. Let's just, just admire it. He stops for a moment, looks as if he's about to hit you, and then goes back to pacing. I'm, <laughs> I understand. You need to focus. Sorry. <laughs> you need to focus on your angry, angry pacing banana window. There's a banana on that window! Can we enter this fine establishment? Ooh, this looks like a smoothie place, maybe? Some kind of health. Oh no, it's just full of apples and stuff. The shelf is filled with dozens of things that might be considered food in a third world country. Boarded up freezer. There are large claw marks in the glass that are on the inside. Well, what is this? This is like a flower shop window. You run your hand along the window. It, surprisingly, unsurprisingly, feels mostly like glass. So let's enter the flower shop. Oh my goodness. Welcome to Stems and Stuff. How can I help you? Nope, just looking over for now. Okay, well, maybe this stuff will all come in handy someday. If we want to buy someone flowers, yeah, if we want to romance the hobo that we just peed on. Very romantic. Then I guess we're gonna do that! Oh! Are you the politician? Ah! Scantily clad woman. No, no, no! We look, but we don't touch. Unless you've paid. We need money! The woman of the night seems to have been working this corner for years. She has the disconnected look of one who's fallen out of love with her chosen profession. <laughs> their chosen profession. Oh, God. Let's go in here. Oh, that's nice. A little, um... The man looks pretty bored. This place must not get too much action overnight. Let's talk to him. You want a room? We rent by the half hour. <laughs> 24 hours, please, and don't ask me to pay. What? Look, if you can't pay, you can't stay. It's it's that simple, man. I'm prepared to offer you a well-crafted tale in payment. Get out! <laughs> Folks just don't appreciate a good story nowadays. I'm sorry, dude. Can we go upstairs? No? Fine. Be like that. Can we interact with this door? Ooh! This dank closet bedroom is thick with a stench of wine. It appears that someone has, in their depression, turned to the escape of the world of miniature equine aficionada. <laughs> Best leave before he returns. What the hell? <laughs> that is amazing. Let's talk to him. Hey, buddy, can I help you? What's going on here? 
Oh, big construction projects, I tell you. Me and my brothers are improving our infrastructure all over the city. Anyways, you can't go that way. Alrighty then. Can I go and uh, lovingly stroke you? You grab a hold of the man's hammer and it rocks your world. <laughs> oh! <gasps> Le duck. Or a pigeon? I don't know. Ah, a pigeon. It's a moderately fat pigeon. He's scrounging for a bit of food. Oh! Oh no! I ate the package and I didn't... I didn't mean to eat the package. You gobble down all the sweet, sweet candy and for a moment you feel fine. You realise that it wasn't candy seconds before your heart explodes. Happy endings for everyone! <laughs> well guys, that'll be it from me for today. Ending on eating a bunch of... Razor blades. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like because that does help me out immensely. If you like this game, then go and support Stone Monkey Studios by buying it on Steam. It's like eight dollars right now, and it's pretty rad. I think it's shaping up to be quite the adventure. It's reminding me of Jazz Punk, and it's all pixely and funny, and it's really like I don't know. It's just it's really witty. I really enjoy that. I really do. Subscribe to me if you haven't already. Be sure to check out more funny misadventures over here and here. But most importantly, take care of yourselves and I will see you soon, my friends. Bye bye Hey man. <laughs> he smelled good. <laughs> he definitely didn't look a bit large. <laughs> none! <laughs> Damn it, none! No bingo for you!